It's another beautiful, magnificent, gorgeous day, deep divers. Listen, there's no place I'd rather be than with the birds, bees, leaves and trees. I woke up like this all magical and fly. How you feeling today, deep divers? Look, let's talk negative energy. Someone actually wrote me a beautiful message. They're like, Ralph, I absolutely love your videos. They've helped me out in so many hard times. But one problem I have, Ralph, is learning right now. I'm struggling, Ralph, like to learn how to block out negative energy and how to not let it get the best of me. Now, I know you can really help on this topic, Ralph. Please make a video on this. Deep divers, the information that I'm about to share with you is going to change your entire life. OK, hit that like button right now if you support the real. Hit that like button right now if you support the real. We got a whole lot to talk about. Absolutely. Let's breathe deep divers, let's go. I feel 10 pounds lighter. Let's go deep divers. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana baby. Raising the frequency. Raising the vibration. Take that, take that, take that. Good ass energy I'm sending you. Peace, infinite waters, diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers, we're out here in the heart of nature. Home sweet home by the beautiful willow tree. There's no Wi-Fi here, deep divers, but I swear there's a better connection. Look, if you are watching this video, I want you to remind yourself to keep trusting the process. You know why? Because everything is in divine order. If you're ready to trust that, just say, I'm born ready, Ralph. I was born ready, Ralph. Gratitude, that's all you gotta say, thank you. That's it, deep divers. Now look, let's talk about negative energy. Like right now in the world, I know, shit's hitting the fan, right? It's crazy. A lot of heavy energy on the planet. It's because a lot of people don't know what's gonna happen next in the world. OK, a lot of people also are around negative people and also a lot of people are creating their own negative mindset every single day. So we're going to talk about it, Deep Divers. By the end of this video, you're going to have all the tools in the world to block out negative energy and also not let negative energy get the best of you. Are you ready, Deep Divers? We're going from we're going from the 3D all the way to the fifth dimension, baby. <laughs> and we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? So let's just talk about the three kinds of negative energies that people go through or experience. Now, there is a negative energy in the world, okay? Look, the world we're living in right now, so much is happening. Wars, Russia and Ukraine. Also, the talk of another pandemic. Oh, not COVID again, right? So there's a lot of negative energy floating around. Also, you have sometimes you interact with negative people. They might even be someone, they may even be someone you know, deep divers, maybe a family friend, definitely not the cat down the road. It could be a friend, a best friend, or even a stranger that comes into your life, maybe even a work colleague. Now they're like ruining your entire life. They're so negative, right? And this energy is now rubbing up on you and it's getting the best of you. you. Used to smile once upon a time, deep divers. Now you're always frowning. Oh my gosh, we've got to change that. And it could also be your own negative mindset that you've created. You see, every single day we've got a choice to be an alchemist or to let things happen to us. You see, Let's start with this, Deep Divers, that word alchemist. Great book by Paolo Coelho. And when you want something, the whole universe conspires to help you achieve it. Fantastic book. We have to be an alchemist when we talk of blocking negative energy and not letting negative energy get the best of us. We have to be an alchemist. Let's just say I wake up 
and it just got ugly, right? It happens. Sometimes you wake up and things are just bad, okay? You've got a choice to allow that to consume you or to transmute the energy. You see, negative energy is not a bad thing. In fact, it's the raw material that you need to go to the next level. Oh my gosh. When you look at a battery, it's negative and positive, but it's the one force. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. So you don't actually have to get rid of negative energy. You have to learn how to work with negative energy so it can be the raw material, the fuel to power you up to go to wherever you want to go. Where do you want to go, deep divers? <laughs> Look, some people have screwed me over, but I use that as fuel. Oh, you're making me mad right now. That's good. You know why? Because I'm going to use that energy to work even harder. It's all about perspective. This is how to block negative energy and to not let negative energy get the best of you. Have a higher perspective, okay? Also become mindful. No, 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 no. Don't have a mindful of negative thoughts, deep dives. No, have a mindfulness. When you wake up, have a mindfulness. That means being mindful. Losing your mind, like the great psychologist Fritz Perl said, lose your mind and come to your senses. This is how to block negative energy and how to not let negative energy get the best of you. So many people have a mindful, bills to pay, relationship problems. You're not satisfied with where you are in, you're not satisfied with where you are right now in life. I know. People pissing you off over there. Bad news, the media full of fear. I know. But deep divers, the good news is that you can choose mindfulness. Change your scenery, your environment. Energy is contagious. There's a reason why Ralph Smart is looking 19, doing a little samba, baby, in the heart of nature, raising the frequency by the beautiful willow tree. It's because nature helps me to release all of that negative energy and transform it into something even better just by coming out into the heart of nature. Do that for yourself every single day. You see, to block negative energy and to not let negative energy get the best of you, you must change your habits. Better habits give you a better life. If you wake up and just ruminate on how many problems you have, all the problems you have, they multiply. Yes, but if you wake up, do one hour meditation, a mindfulness meditation, or you go hiking, or you go swimming, or you just sit with your emotions and you forgive yourself. All of a sudden you start healing yourself. That negative energy starts to fade away and is replaced with better positive energy. Look, if you are someone right now who has a hard time dealing with negative energy that you've created or someone else has created, remind yourself, Learn how to master your energy. Learn how to master the E, motion. What is the E motion? The energy in motion. Whoever angers you controls you, deep divers. Yes. So learn to realize you have so many different emotions passing through you every single second. You want to learn how to control this emotion, the energy in motion. You want to learn how to master your emotions, your feelings. How not to allow something so small to ruin your entire day. You need to realize you can always choose to feel peace. The reason why deep divers, so many people are full of negative energy. You know why? Because they let something so small upset their entire day. You know why? Because they were reactors. They were reacting to everything. Life is not something happening to you. Life is responding to you, deep divers, your words, thoughts, and actions. You have power. You're not a victim of circumstance. You're a co-creator of your own reality and you can create a more positive reality for yourself by having a greater perspective, by realizing 
right now, I am going to master this energy in motion. Right now, I'm going to choose to respond and not react. How you respond to a situation can literally change the entire situation itself. This is how to block negative energy, how to not allow negative energy to get the best of you. Take a moment before you do something stupid, deep divers, take a moment of silence to say, is this the best action that's going to bring me peace of mind or is this going to piss me off even more? Okay, remind yourself every single day, deep divers, to vibrate higher. Negativity can only affect you when you are vibrating at that same frequency. Vibrate higher. Raise the frequency. How do you vibrate higher? Do a little samba, baby. How do you vibrate higher? Don't sweat the small stuff. How do you vibrate higher? Listen to some, listen to some beautiful birds singing in the heart of nature. That's how deep divers. Maybe a Tibetan sound bath, some Indian Banzuri flute music, giving you some suggestions, deep divers, some classical music. Okay, because we've got to remind ourselves we are energy. Everything is energy. All is energy. And if you want to turn negative energy into better energy, positive energy, you're going to have to bring it into your life. You're going to have to bring that positive energy into your life. You're going to have to, as soon as you wake up, don't look at bad news. Tune into yourself. I always tell you, focus on yourself and practice gratitude. Count your blessings, not your problems. Oh my gosh, it's starting to feel like that old infinite waters again, deep divers. Look. I'm not positive all the time. You don't have to be positive all the time. Authenticity includes both negativity and positivity. A lot of people are having a hard time with negativity because they want it gone. It's never going to go. Your negativity is actually your shadow side, which you have to actually incorporate into your own life. You have to fuse with your shadow to bring yourself into that state of neutrality where you're not so positive, not so negative, you're just in the middle. An equal balance of positive and negative. Okay, not too high, not too low, deep divers. <laughs> to not let negative energy get the best of you. Remind yourself, do I want my smile to go away because someone interrupted and interfered with my day? No, I'm not gonna allow people who do so little to me who do so little for me to take up such a large space in my mind. I said, I'm not going to allow people who do so little for me, deep divers, to take up such a large space in my mind rent free. Stop giving people that power over your own emotions. Let me repeat that. I said, stop giving people out there so much power over your own internal emotions. Take the helm of your own life, deep divers. Remind yourself to set up healthy, energetic boundaries. Like I told you, we are all absorbing all kinds of energy. Some is, some of the energy, some of the energy is fantastic. Bring it on. Some of the energy is, uh, I don't need that. You don't need that. So set up a healthy, energetic boundary. There are some places forbidden, right? They say, do not trespass. Don't go here. You don't go there because the energy is no good. But there are certain places which welcome you in like nature. Open arms, go there. Remind yourself, four words, this too shall pass. Whatever you're going through, you are going through it and you are growing through it and you will come out of the other side even stronger. You see, to not allow negative energy to get the best of you, remind yourself every single day, deep divers, that fear is the greatest energy vampire. Fear is false evidence appearing real or it can be face everything can rise. But fear is how they control you in this matrix. It is the lowest frequency, 100 hertz frequency. And you don't want to be there. You don't want to be in a state of fear, a perpetual state of fear 24 seven. No, you want to allow yourself to let go of what no longer serves you to make space 
for what inspires you and takes you higher. This is how to not allow negative energy to get the best of you. When was the last time, deep divers, you did something for yourself? When was the last time you went on holiday to become whole again? Give yourself that privilege once again to have that me time so you can heal yourself, replenish your energy. Deep divers. Fear is the greatest energy vampire. So what does that mean? It means that love is the greatest energy generator. And this is how to not allow negative energy to get the best of you. Remind yourself to be in that love frequency, that heart frequency. Your heart is 100,000 times more powerful than your brain, 5,000 times stronger magnetically than your brain. Okay? Remind yourself every single day that seven day vegan challenge, food is energy. Every 35 days, your body makes new cells from the foods you are consuming. Food is energy. So when you start eating more leafy greens, plant-based foods, kale, all of that arugula, the leafy greens, you start eating all of those phytonutrients the magnesium calms you down. It helps you feel in a peace. That's what you need to do. Leonardo da Vinci said, I will no longer make my body a tomb for other creatures. You see, you can eat whatever you want to eat, deep divers, pork chops, hot dogs, whatever. Fantastic. I'm happy for you. But what helped me along my journey was to realize that everything is energy. When you butcher and kill an animal, that energy isn't gone. It's transferred onto your plate. And you're going to eat it and then have the same fear the animal had when it was being slaughtered. Oh my gosh, the connection is everywhere, deep divers. So, to not allow negative energy to get the best of you, ask yourself, am I consuming love or am I consuming pain and suffering? Peace begins on your plate. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Where did the negative energy go, deep divers? We just got a calm breeze. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Don't forget to breathe. Inhale that good shit. Exhale the stress. Deep divers, remind yourself. Change your mind and you change your world. Your thoughts are like magnets, which draw to you what you already have within yourself. If you wake up with a negative mindset, you're gonna draw negative, you're gonna draw negative experiences into your life. It's that simple. But if you wake up with a state of gratitude, you will attract more things to be grateful for in your life. That means better experiences that are going to contribute to your mental and emotional wellness. Deep divers, can you see the link? Yes, you can. So choose to feel good inside first before you choose to feel good outside because it might take a mighty long time for the outside to get good. But what you do have power over is your internal. Focus on what you can control, which is always the inner world, which is always the inner world. And remind yourself, don't speak about what you don't want. Speak about what you do want. So many people say, my life is terrible right now. I'm going through a massive breakdown. Things aren't good. They're terrible. Now that's cool to be honest, but you want to learn a higher form of alchemy. Instead of saying, my life's not going the way I want, it's terrible. Say, I'm going through a great period of transformation right now. And I know at the end, I'm gonna be someone who's gone through so much to have so much wisdom and I'm becoming stronger during this experience. So if you're going through a hard time, instead of saying, this hard time is gonna kill me, say, I'm becoming stronger. Thank you, universe, for sending me this hard experience. I know by the end of it, I'm going to be a whole different person. So you're saying an affirmation, not in terms of what you don't want, but in terms of what you do want. In other words, you're casting spells. You're now speaking what you want into existence. And all of a sudden, you have now, you have now not allowed negative energy to get the best of you. And then you've just said, feels so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Beautiful deep divers. I'm just, that was pure. Let's go deep divers. Woo, breathing in that good ass prawn, baby. <laughs> Hit that like button right now, deep divers, if you support the real.
Hit that like button right now, Deep Divers, if you support The Real. Go and check out the number one best-selling book, Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book, The Bible of Becoming Your Greatest Version. Also, go and check out the latest new book, The Book of 1111 Infinite Quotes, The Secret Recipe to Becoming Your Greatest Version at ralphsmart.com slash the book. Go and get the good ass Prana shirts, Deep Divers too. All new limited edition designs for men, women, children, even cats at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. And if you're a sexy ass model, woo, with a whole lot of heart, you want to model the clothing? Well, go and buy some. We're doing the fashion show in California. We're doing the fashion show in London. We're doing the fashion show in Miami. We're doing the fashion show in Senegal. If you want to be an Infinite Waters model, make sure you DM me on Instagram right now at official Ralph Smart. They tried to bury us deep divers. They forgot we were seeds. Remind yourself that what you consume will consume you. You have a choice on what you focus on. You can focus on the doom and gloom or you can focus on the way out until eventually it becomes a way out and you rise from the ashes like the phoenix. Negativity does not have to govern your life unless you allow it to. You can choose to embody love until it becomes a reality in your own life. One love, deep divers. One love, peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy, peace. You once again, deep divers, hit that like button right now if you support the real. Hit that like button right now if you support the real. Share this video with someone, okay? Leave a comment down below of gratitude and appreciation and let me know how this video inspired you to not allow negative energy to get the best of you. Deep divers, one love is one love. It's one love. Peace.